guys welcome to my fifth c plus plus tutorial in this tutorial i'm going to show you what is loop and how it used in the c plus plus here you can see the format loops are actually used for the repetition of one times or what we want how much we want it runs and you can see this is all the format of loops actually basically there are three types of rule for loops while loop for loop while loop do while loop in this tutorial i'm going to show you what is for loops and how it works so let's see here you can see first declare x and and now we are in the for first write the what from where the loop starts like uh, first uh, declare i and it start with zero and now put the end point and where the loop end like i write it end with the x that we uh, uh, that we ask from the user and i plus plus it means i increment and uh, it actually work plus one uh, first uh, the loop runs and then it will increase uh, to plus one like if uh, i equal to zero it runs one time and then this will execute and the uh, uh, value of i will be one and then again two three and the uh, and with the x where we write and now i'm going to i and this is a new thing handle handle mean new line and line it uh, print i and go to the second line and that line will be and and this is the again operator of c out we can write many times what we want and i'm going to run it oh no this is error no uh, here you can see this is and input like uh, you want to print the uh, 17 here you can see the loop start with the 0 and end with the 16 because 16 is less than 17 and if we write equal to then it will be 17 and it will be end with the 17 now this all are the format of the for loop actually there is the actually we also uh, use the for in the for at in the that's all and I also first declare it j less than 4 j plus plus j increment see how it Here you can see it runs many of times actually the inner loop runs multiple of that and that times and the outer loop runs that times we can also print the uh, table of uh, numbers like uh, you go to five table of fives Five, five multiplied by i that is and equal to oh sorry and then equal to five multiplied i and then and here you can see it print five multiplied by and this is the i values which uh, readily changed and this is equal to and this is the process which uh, which we done uh, with the loop done and now i'm going to print and you can see 10 as you can see 5 multiplied by 0 and uh, and with the 10 
so if you have any question please comment and keep visiting my next tutorial to learn a lot